Hello all of my friends, it's pizza night tonight, so let's make the dough for the first. I have a three cups of the bread flour and also one and a half cup of the warm water. It's just warm, not hot. And also I have a two teaspoon of the yeast and one tablespoon of sugar and one teaspoon of the salt. And I put it together into the warm water to mix them. and about one tablespoon of olive oil and let them rest for about a minute before we mix into the flour and uh, we let them the yeast we let the yeast like uh, bubbling on the top like that okay so after a minute look at the yeast it's bubbling on the top so we put in together into the flour and then we mix them, incorporate them together, put into the middle like so. And I'm using my clean hand. And I put more flour into the wok surface here. they're completely smooth and elastic This is the texture that I'm looking for, spongy, and then I'm going to put back into the bowl, put about a one tablespoon of the olive oil into the bowl, and put back the, the dough in, and cover them for about uh, one hour to let them rest and into double size. So I will see you in about an hour. This is our double sized dough. And then I'm going to put the flour into the box surface again, like so. And put the dough just like this. I really do be careful to fold them. And now I divide them into three. I just make them, I make three pieces. More flour. Just going to turn like so. And then let them rest for another 30 minutes. Look my friends, it is another double size of dough. So put in the 
icing paper. Okay, this time for topping, and I'm using the can pizza sauce for today. But actually, you can use for you know just a handmade by yourself like that. But it's really take time from tomatoes and basil and some herbs what you like. But it's really take time. So today I'm using the can, and I'm just make uh, two pizzas with the uh, cheese and the um, topping and the other one I will make like a focaccia just uh, um, salt pepper and butter or something like that make the plain one for one and then these two is different kind of topping so but actually for the topping you can just make whatever you like meat fresh meat or ham or whatever but here now I have, uh, I have a ham, chicken ham, so I'm going to put the big one, chicken ham, I will put the ham and the pineapple, here it's kind of how I am, something like that. So, and also the second one, I put the chipolata sausage, Italian chipolata sausage, this is what I have in the freezer, in the fridge, sorry. And like so, just do as much as you like. And then I put the shredded mozzarella cheese on the top. Like so. Then for the ham and the pineapple and I already hit the oven for a bake the pizzas on the 190 degree and uh, we will bake them for about 25 minutes or until they are uh, golden brown and look like a crisp the the base grips the pizza base something like that yeah. and another mozzarella on the top look at that how beautiful they are yeah and this is for the last one just pepper Butter on the top, like so. It's for the plain. All right, so we put into the oven for about twenty five minutes, and I will show you how it looks like. Alright my friends, so this is all of the pizzas we have, the result, and the chipotle is a little bit of brown. Still very hot, look how moist they are. Okay, thank you my friends for watching my pizzas and I hope you enjoyed and if you are curious and you have to try it at home, please give me thumbs up and click the ring button. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video.